Hello everyone and welcome back. I'm the FBL Penguin. I hope you're all doing good. I know we're still in the middle, well, near the end, should I say, of game week five in the English Premier League. But I want to talk about, if you aren't playing it already, or maybe you are, uh, the European Champions League is back. And, um, you know, if you fancy football, if you're a fan of the European UEFA Champions League fancy football, this is for you. Uh, I'll leave the league code right there on the screen so you can see. If you want to join my league, I've got about over 240, 240 members in it already. So it's going to be a lot of competition. So the bigger it gets, the more people in it, it'd be great. You know, more competition. So this is my um, confirmed game week one uh, UEFA Champions League fantasy team. I was tinkering about a bit of it, but I'll come to the right team I want the team I want so I've gone for the Ajax goalkeeper I think with Ajax I think they've well they've got the first game against the French side Lille who Pepe the new Arsenal winger used to play for I I don't know what Lille are like now in the French league but I'm sure they would be a lot lot more weak as a team without Pepe in their side so I've gone for the Ajax goalkeeper fantastic last season Ajax uh, made it to the semi-final Unfortunate to lose to Spurs. Um, they were all heroes. They were. And could they do it again? Who knows? But they're missing one of the key men, which is uh, De Jong, De Jong, who has gone to Barcelona. Uh, he was like their glue in the middle, the passes and everything. And it depends. They're doing all right in the, in the Dutch league. But when it comes to Champions League, more competitive, stronger, stronger teams. How are they going to fare? Who knows? But I expect them to do pretty well this season. Hopefully qualify from the group. So I've gone for the Ajax goalkeeper um, in my as my goalkeeper in my team. Uh, the back for Dubos, Dubos, uh, the, who plays for Leon. I assume that he's he's nailed on to start. But I've been watching it. Well, seem he's been starting quite a few Leon's games this season in the league in the French league. He's left back, and uh, I, 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 you know he's like this budget left back. So I've gone for him. The left back for Ajax as well, confident of a clean sheet. And he can score, I think he scored two goals or did he get two assists recently in the Dutch league? I don't know, but he did something. And he's a very good good left back, one of their key players. So I've gone for him, good assist, could, could be a good goal scorer as well. The Bayern Munich centre back, mostly can get a goal if, if he wants from a set piece. Very tall, very big. Uh, Sul, if that's how you pronounce the name. Playing this team from Serbia, I expect them to win 4 or 5 nil at home there to this team. Uh, that's why I've got big uh, Lewandowski up front <laughs> as my captain. I'll get to him in a minute. I also got Trent Alexander-Arnold. You can't rule him out. He's taking our set pieces. Well, our corners. I especially remember that one against Barcelona that won it. I'm a Liverpool fan, so I'm over the moon. Uh, so you got to have him. He's one, be one of the key players again for us this season. In midfield, as I've gone for 4 4 2 uh, gone for Kevin De Bruyne, Salah, Mane, and Tyson. Tyson from Tyson from uh, that's right, from Shakhtar Donetsk. He's done all right in the uh, Ukrainian league so far, Tyson. Um, but I'd say completely different ball game when it comes to Champions League, much stronger teams. But City still no Laporte. It showed against uh, Norwich that they're a bit weak at the back, and it's said Shakhtar. And I do think they could possibly damage Man City. I, ex I expect a good game. Probably City might come out on top. Who knows if they play the cards right. But Tyson, being at home, I think he'll cause City some damage. Salah and Mane against Napoli away. We lost 1-0 to Napoli last season in the summer stage. So deja vu. I hope not. And I hope Salah and Mane do get a job done. Also, I want them for the long term. Same with... De Bruyne there. So Kevin De Bruyne only played the last 30 minutes against Norwich in a 3-2 defeat. And I expect a fit and ready De Bruyne to go at Shakhtar Donetsk and get something against them. So assist gold mad. Up front, I got Tadic. He's one of their key men, arguably their best player uh, right now. And was last season. The former Southampton guy made a huge hit at uh, South at uh, Ajax. Uh, last season, his first season at Ajax, and expect to do it again. So great team to come up against Lille at home, and um, Lewandowski. 
captain against the Serbian team I never even heard of. I expect him to go for he's been he started the season off well in the Bundesliga and I expect like a 4-5-0 win here for Bayern Munich. I really do. And obviously they got Spurs and Olympiacos, but I expect them to top the group and I expect the big guy, the big Polish international to get quite a few goals in this group for Bayern Munich. So yeah, that's my team. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video and you know, let me know if you're playing it if or what your team is. Put your team down below what your team is. And this is my locked in team now. Join my league. Code's right there. And I'm looking forward to this. I'm looking forward to tomorrow and Wednesday night. Champions League is back. Liverpool, the reigning uh, Champions League winner six times. Six times. I was I was watching at the pub last season. Uh, watching my team lift off six European Cup after 14 years. Hell of a long time. But I'm hoping, I don't know if we'll do it again, but I think we could because we've been to the last two Champions League finals and, you know, do it a third time in a row and win it again. Who knows? And I hope you enjoyed this video. Please get a thumbs up. Please subscribe. Follow me on Twitter. Follow me on Instagram. FPL underscore Penguin. I'll leave the down below they're a bit different so fpl underscore penguin one and fpl underscore penguin and yeah really appreciate it and i shall see you guys in the next video probably tonight or probably tomorrow probably tomorrow my game week five uh review uh video on how i got on because i still got heat and lanzini to play and i've got 54 points in that uh team so far so thanks to abamyang Mane and Pookie. King Pookie. He can't stop scoring. All of all the Pookie Express. Let's go, boys. Hope you enjoy the Champions League this Tuesday and Wednesday. I shall see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.